Hello everybody, it's Daz Ren for your tree, and we're back with some more Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate Let's Play, and we're going to fight today a Durambaros. We're going to be trying to save Chacha. Apparently he's in trouble, so first of all, we're going to talk to the fishmonger. Then I'm going to show you all the items I have ready for this battle because I don't know what to expect. I've never fought such a creature before in all my life. So let's talk to this girl here. Right, so there's two guys back from their fishing expedition. We have a black pearl. Two gr or crown gemstones and another black pearl. We've got match light ore, broken shell, a steel egg for money, and black pearl again. Right, so we can sell those items, just the one egg. Uh, we're going to dispatch the guys again. We made a few upgrades. Today we can journey somewhere new. Right, so let's go to legendary tides this time. Atlantis crab and mystic narwhal. He's going to be away for six days. Oh my god. Let's give him a perfect paddle. Off you go. Feeling great today. We might even be able to hunt some monsters. Says Red. So here it is. Distant Isle. They can get Gobble, Hide and Dash Extract. So let's send you there. And we will get you... We don't have any hunting stuff. You can give him a spare spear. And we're off. He's still at sea. Okay, so that is it. Now, let's go and have a meal. I'm going to show you my items then after that. My meal. I hope. I hope I remember. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's good here? What's good? What's good? Help your weapon retain sharpness. That's not good for me. Escape artist. Decrease stamina depletion when fleeing from large monsters. I like that. And prevent fainting one time when damage taken exceeds your remaining health. That might be alright. I don't plan on fainting. Not like the last episode. Unfortunately, we took on Ligiacris, a capture quest in the flooded forest. It's just so small in there and he got me. Yes, we got the two of them. Okay. So here's my items, guys everybody right so we've got mega potions we've got nutrients to extend our maximum health bar we've got our well done steaks we've got paintball paintball flash bombs tranquilizers in case you want to capture them to capture traps we've also got some slicing s ammo that's over in this section because we're full of uh, weapons at the moment or full of ammo at the moment we've got clust level one uh, i haven't used that before but apparently it uh causes tree explosions so We've got barrel bombs as well this time. We've made barrel bomb L by com by combining a barrel bomb L with scatter fish. So that's a barrel bomb L plus. Powered up barrel bomb L. Deadly. Waterproof so it still works on the water. And we've got our barrel bomb S for easy detonation. That's like your fuse. Now, our ammo. We've got all the same ammo as you're used to. But this time, I've made poison ammo level 2 with a toadstool and a bone husk s instead of a bone or a berry husk whatever it was so uh, i think we're ready to go we'll poison Duma duramboros we'll blow him up we'll shoot him loads and hopefully cha cha will emerge safe and sound why is this a green tick oh it's complete for now or something like that shakalaka savior number two flooded forest let's do this actually let's read the thing because i've never seen this quest before uh one of our rangers in the flooded forest saw a Duran Boros chasing something. It was a cute little thing, knee high to a Vespoid, kind of like the little pal of yours. Mind stopping the Duran Boros and saving this mystery pipsqueak? Forest Defense Force, let's do it! And for this one, I'm a lone ranger because I don't have my little acorn sidekick, unfortunately, because he's in trouble. So let's save him. Let's save our little buddy. Help! I'm Chacha! <laughs> we got a blue trap. What's the blue trap? Easy pitfall trap. Oh! I don't think I've ever seen one of them before. Okay, he's in area number two. Chaka laka. That isn't Chacha. Chacha's little character was always yellow. This one's a blue one. And it looks like just under my. You see my Dazren Trio Tree name, and I'm using the heavy bowgun. That looks like, like a blue helmet. Kayamba lost. Kayamba. I have never seen this guy before. He's got mushrooms growing on him. What? <laughs> Holy shizwazzle. He's dazed. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh 
Holy crap, this guy is huge. Look at the size of his tail! Okay, that didn't work. Yes, cats, blow him up. Shit. Okay, I don't even know what weapon to use. I'm freaking out here. He's a bit slow, all right. Oh, God. Maybe I spoke too soon. Don't pick on the cats, you. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Holy shit. Take that, you son of a... <clears throat> yeah! Did nothing. <laughs> it looked like it did nothing. You... You smell. Stay there, stay there! That'll do ya. No. Oh my god. Oh my god! Hey, his roar didn't affect me. He can walk through those stones! I thought it was somewhat- Oh my god! I thought that would act as a lovely little defensive point for me. That'll do ya. Oh my good god, that is savage! Oh my god! Alright, he's going for it again, he's going for it again. First aid meds, please. Is that getting closer to me or what? Oh my god! I thought he was gonna stay there for a little bit. I thought that's what the guild lady said. There you go, right under you. Shit, man, this guy is kicking my ass. Move, move, move! Ugh. I'll take my mega nutrients now. Oh my god, that stone's in my way. Shakalaka! Are you getting up or what? Holy crap. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. Okay, he's just swinging himself again. He is coming for me! Stop, will ya? Shit, man, he can fly across the map. Oh. He is a huge man. <laughs> he's not a man, he's a monster. Nice one, a round acorn, that's gonna serve you well. Now does that mean he's gone out of this area or is that some sort of attack? Can this guy get up? Oh, this is gonna go... Alright, first aid med, that's gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine, Shekalaka. Kayamba. Okay, he's obviously a ground... He obviously stays on ground, so he's only going to be in areas 2, 4, 1, 7, and maybe 9 and 10 if he goes all the way that, back that far. Is that him making all that noise? Alright, let's paintball him next time.
Man, this guy is tough. Yeah, here he is. Let's reload our weapon. I've just realized. He must have seen me. Oh, give over with that. He's gonna get me, isn't he? <laughs> Where'd he go? Okay, maybe he didn't go that far then. Oh, now he's down. Shit, I'm panicking. I'm zooming in in places that I'm not supposed to be. Shit. Shit. He's like a moving country. Yeah. <laughs> that last bullet just cracked something on him. Stupid little frickin' Banahabara. Shit, 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 shit. It's gone all the way back to area number two. I don't even know if I'm making a dent in him, this guy. This is I've really enjoyed this though. This is my first time ever seeing a new kind of a new monster and he's really powerful and I'm I'm trying to learn his attacks and <laughs> This is fun. He's eaten. He's got loads of branches in his mouth. His tail! Watch out for the tail! Oh, he still got me! Oh, look at the cat! No, the little cat! Wait, what's he doing here? Okay. His, <laughs> his front legs are up off the ground, that's hilarious! Oh, he didn't go jumping into the air that time. Oh, 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 no, 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 no! Oh, he turned! Shit. This guy is crazy. Can we stun him? Yes. That's better. Hopefully he doesn't do any kind of moves now. Oh, come back. He's doing a swing a Rooney. Swing a Rooney. <laughs> he doesn't have a really loud growl. Oh my god, he went there straight away! Holy shit. I think I've made him mad. Alright, let's get one more drink in really quick. I'm gonna try out my clust ammo. Oh, poison him! That's what I meant to do. 
I had so many things I wanted to do, but I just can't be. I can't concentrate. I try. I don't know what to do. Stop it. looking at this. Uh oh, I'm at the edge of the map. Start tumbling. He's gonna lift up. Holy god. Oh yeah. Oh, he's not tired. I thought sometimes when he does that he's tired. Alright, he's poisoned. Reload, I've only got one bullet in my chamber. Good, good. Now, this time he didn't leave the area by digging into the ground, did he? No, he walked out. He walked out on me, man. Let's get some rations. This guy is freaking crazy. I meant to show you guys as well. In Moga Woods, the day I'm fighting this guy, there was a Racian and there was a Royal Ludrat. Oh, that would have been a nice battle in Moga Woods. Quit it. That broke his horns. Damn it. Come on. I have nowhere to go. He makes me put my weapon away every time he does that. Oh, he did get me. With his roar. I thought he couldn't get me. Shit, there's a tree in my way. Shit, he's getting closer. <laughs> oh, I knew that tail was going to get me. I just tumbled it all the way up before him. Or up, up his forward way or whatever you want to say. I can't even think of what I'm supposed to say properly. <sighs> I think I can do siege mode with this ammo. No, I can't. Okay, I can't. I'd say Duran Boros is weak to fire somehow. But I'm not going to chance it. I'm going to poison him first. At least while he's poisoned, he takes extra demo. What I'm, what extra de damage? What I'm not doing anything to him.
Come on, get ready to go. One shot. Is he poisoned? No, still not poisoned. Oh, that tail's gonna get you. It cancelled my reload animation, thankfully. Yeah, he's poisoned again. Good. How about some Pierce rounds? I cut right through him. Excellent. Here he goes. Oh no, he didn't go. That's it. Goes straight to my bullets. It's a paint bottom again. Oh, how could you miss? How could you miss such a big character? <laughs> Jesus criminy. Flaming S siege mode after stunning him, I think. That's in order. Where's he going? He's coming after me with his tail, he's turned his ass to me. Not good enough. Ready for capture, but I want to do some more damage on him. Jesus. Let's see if he comes over here. That's it. Come on. I'm gonna let him land on me. I'm gonna stay here and then move at the last second. <laughs> Come on. You're an asshole. You're an asshole. Man, my capturing leaves something to be desired lately. I'm just gonna kill him. I don't have to capture this guy, I could just kill him. Well, I'm gonna shoot him anyway. Maybe he'll retreat to the next area. Maybe he'll retreat back to number two. Because that's where he eats, so...
out of here. Let's get ready to trank bombs. I think he's just going back to... Oh, he's in area number 10. Damn it. <laughs> I thought area number 2 was his area. I have to say, I'm pretty impressed with the clust ammo and against this guy, it was pretty good. I'm gonna get away from those cats, go around the other way. Go away, stupid cats. Thank you, thank you, cats, thank you. Ah, that's what you get now. Ah, oh, you little teeth. You round acorn stealing so and so. You're gonna get killed. I hope you know that much. I'm gonna get hit by that, am I? Ah. Great little area you could get your little You could get your branches in area number two. You'll get loads of health, I tell ya. Come on. He broke down the tree. I need to get my weapon out, but he's freaking out on me here. Uh oh. Aha, uh -huh, so when he starts swinging his tail, just go ahead of him. <laughs> I love the way his front legs lift off the ground. Stop it, cats. Told ya. He just walked over that. Oh, he's drooling all over the place. You're disgusting. Yeah, you can have the old pickaxe. Now get out of here. Come on, area number two. Oh, the trap is gone. I could trap him here. Oh no! Oh, that's just it. Give me back the well done stakes. Come on, over here. That's it. Yay! It took long enough, but objective is complete. And that frickin' cat made away with my well done stakes! Oh well. If I could get my. Yeah, there we go. Was there a shiny thing here? Is this my well done stakes? No, he made off with them, didn't he? Secret stash. Duramboros is no more. That was my first time ever fighting a Duramboros. I, ha oh. I have to say that was pretty frickin' brilliant. I really enjoyed that fight. He's huge! I think I broke the horn on his back. The two horns on his back. Or maybe that's just the way he is, I'm not sure. He is huge. 
Let's look. Ah, look at me! I killed the Duramboros! <laughs> or captured, even. I'd love if he just woke up and just went... <sighs> Om nom nom nom. Two cowboy shoes hanging out of his mouth. Alrighty. Quest complete. That took forever and a day. But see the size of me. He's the biggest thing I've ever seen. Arrgh. Sent to item box. We've got Duram moss plate. Duram tail case. Duram Boro shell, another shell, a tail case, monster bone plus, monster bone L, wyvern fang, armor spheres, bone husk, mystery charm, and two more armor spheres. Then for capturing him, we got Duram Boro's horn, a moss plate, shell, horn, and a hump. The hump of a Duram Boros's back. The fatty skin produces sturdy, pliable equipment when crafted. Now I think as a special little treat after beating Duran Boros, I'm going to sh show uh, Ranger plus two. I'm going to show the uh, armor you can make from Duran Boros. Mountain versus mole has been added to the gallery. <laughs> I wonder what happens with Kiemba. He's just still lying in area number two. Hey. Whoa! The old man's always laughing at those shakalakas. Alright, we're going to end off the episode, but first of all, let's have a look at the armor you can make from a Duran Boros. Let's see if we can make some armor from Duran Boros at some stage. Let's have a look. Headpiece of Duran Boros. Well, we're going to look at the cap. Oh my god. That's kind of cool. That is that is really cool. I like the eyes. What about the Bladesman one? Which one's cooler? Hmm. I like the one horn, but that's kind of cool looking. Durum Boros. Uh, what about the stats? What does it give you? Let's have a look. Duran Boros gives you attack up, recovery speed up, and survivor up, but expert down. I think survivor keeps you alive if you're just about to die. Uh, it keeps you alive with like a sliver of health left. Let's check the chest piece. No, we don't have it. Just the head piece so far. There's Duran Boros. Guards. Oh my god, look at it. <laughs> That's cool. Doran Boros coat. And the folds. And let's finish it off then with the legs. Doran Boros. Leggings. Oh yeah, look at the... <laughs> look at the blades on the feet and then the shin of the right leg. And the greaves. That's for the blade guys. That's quite savage. Alright, hope you enjoyed the episode. We took on a Doran Boros, we didn't faint, we saved Kiamba. It wasn't Chacha, unfortunately, but uh, let's see what is next in the next episode now, because um, the kind of story is changing. There was never a fight with Doran Boros on the Wii version, and Kiamba was never in the Wii version, so maybe we're going in a new direction now, so maybe everything from here on in is completely new, as opposed to just fighting an Azuros and a Rogi uh, every now and again, but yeah, hope you enjoyed this episode. And let's see what the next one brings. Hope to see you there. Goodbye. Goodbye.